Okay, here we are back again with some Wukong. Um, my plan is to try and finish the game. Um, I looked up how to get the true ending. Oh, hey, Bajay. Um, and from what I saw, you have to like do all the secrets and stuff in the other levels. So, um, I want to beat the game. I don't know if I will in this recording, but that's my plan. I want to beat the game. Maybe go for the true ending, but it depends on how long that takes. Maybe I'll start it and finish another episode. I'll see. I dawdle here. Move along, quick. Yeah, yeah. But that's my plan this time. Is I, I want to beat the game. Also, I moved my webcam up. I should have done this a long time ago, like at the very beginning of the recording, so that way you could see like my abilities there on the bottom right. Cause that's been covered up the entire playthrough uh but it's whatever <clears throat> it is what it is <clears throat> yeah last time we went they're attacking the mountain holy shit all these fucking chains bro okay this looks like a boss area Uh, bad luck. It's a dead end. Uh, 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 you nasty slanderer! I let you be, and now you have the gall let to him show be. up. If you come at me now, this day will be your last. What is that fucking thing? It's a hand, Griffin. Supreme Inspector. That's kind of crazy. Inspector with a hand or a head. Oh, God. That's like... Okay. Oh yes, stop that. Oh my god. Okay, look. I just booted up the game, okay? I woke up like two hours ago. Oh my god, he grabbed me. What is this dude? Oh, it summons tornadoes! Oh yeah, I think I remember this. I forgot about it. Damn it! I hit the wrong fucking button. Jesus, I was trying to harden, but uh, I think I was hitting like alt or like X or something instead of Z, which is my harden button. Oh, he does take fire damage. Yeah, I'm dead. I actually did a lot better that time though. Oh, is this like a second phase? Well, that, I made this a second episode. That time was a lot better. Bro, can you stop with these fucking combos, man? Oh, now we're in the second phase. I'm still taking damage! That's bullshit in the cutscene! Oh, I thought I had enough mana to harden. That was bullshit, I was still taking damage in the cutscene. 
Oh my god, those combos, bro. They don't stop. Jesus. Yeah. Get to the second phase. See, it still damages me, and I can't control it! What?! That knocked me out of my fucking spirit? Bullshit! Oh my god. That was bullshit. It knocked me out of my spirit transformation. Damn it. Fuck, I did to the fire damage there. Ugh. Okay, in that second area, the fire thing would really come in handy instead of the tornado thing. So I think I'll try some more with the tornado thing that I have, but if that doesn't work out too well, then that second area, then, then I'll just get rid of it and I'll uh, use the fire thing or try it out. Stop fucking moving! That's such a bullshit, bro, that he can go outside the bounds! That's so cheap! Bro, those combos! They, they last for 50,000 fucking years. I actually made it past the second phase that time. But still. That second phase is frustrating because it's, it's similar to, uh... The Sand Prince or whatever in the second level, the final boss of that one. That one, though, wasn't intentional. Like, that one, at least I don't think it was intentional. Like, that one was just, he could just leave the area. This one, though, was, like, intentionally made to where he can leave the Ring of Fire and you can't. And that is fucking annoying. Because he can still attack you while he's out of there. And that, to me, is absolute bullshit. There shouldn't be a case where a boss can go to a place where you can't hit them. That's not even, like, you can get to him somehow. You straight up can't get to him as far as I'm aware. Maybe you can't, I don't know, but... That's just irritating. Just fucking kill me. Whatever. Yeah, just kill me at that point. I fucked that big time. Right there. My dodges were just shit. Oh my god. I got hit. I just got crumbled there. I actually I had a really good start to that one. I took out like a fourth of his health bar. Or like 40% of his health bar at the beginning, and then I just got clapped. Alright. Are you fucking kidding me, bro? Come on! I thought he was going- like, when he did that last wheel thing, I thought he was gonna get off and stop like he did, but he continued the attack. Usually, when he does that five wheel thing, he just gets off and, like, sits there for a bit. So that's why I was like, oh, I'll use that opportunity to go for a heavy attack. But no, that time he still went for the attack, and it stunned me out of my heavy attack. Was so close right there. Oh, so close. Fuck. That tornado thing is actually great in that. Se I don't know if the tornado thing is what knocked him out of that second phase, because if so, I'll save it for that second phase. Or if it just happened to be time up for that. But if it knocked him out of that, I'll save it for that second phase. Okay, second phase. Yes, that takes him out of it. Wow. Uh, I was close there. Okay, so I did find out the tornado does actually take him out of that second phase. So I'm just going to save the tornado for that second phase. And to use it there. Because, yeah, once I hit him with that, it immediately knocks him out of the fire phase. Which is great for me.
I accidentally hit the left click button. Keep hitting right click. There's a second phase. Yeah, and I'm just spamming T. <laughs> Get this tornado out. Yes! Oh! Okay. Yeah, that fan made it way easier in that fight. Oh my god, what's happening to my frame rate? <laughs> he just picked my ass up. That fight took me an hour and a half, by the way. What is that? Oh, that's the cloud. Why couldn't you give me that at the fucking beginning of the game? This shit would have been. Somersault Cloud. I was wringing my brain how to fetch you, but this savvy one's already on it. It must have been hidden here amongst the mist until it sensed the relics on you. Thanks to them, it recalled its master and saved your skin. I'll take it. It answers to your call. Why not make good use of it? Ah, your mortal body is too heavy for me in my wind form. <laughs> oh, he was like, yeah, I could have... Because I wouldn't be able to pick you up. What draws them to this mountain? Let's find out! Mount Huago. Damn, that was a cool, like, somersault cloud. One somersault covers 100,000 high fields. That achievement, too, but I didn't read it. Jeez, I'm sensing the aura of the great sage. The summer cloud is now willing to heed the call of the destined one. However, despite its ability to 
for extensive travel, it can only be used within the territory of me. Oh, okay. Oh my god, my frame rate. What is my frame rate at? Holy shit, my frame rate is tanking like this. That's like a boss over there. What the f- Alright. There's a giant fucking cricket over there. Can I fight it here? Where to go? Guess I can't fight it. No, let's go take a look around here. There's like a big area to explore here. Yeah, my frame rate isn't great while I'm up here, but I mean that's understandable. It's gotta load in all this shit, and I'm on this cloud. Son of stones. Moves him so far away, though. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, maybe I fucked with the wrong one. Oh. I tried to uh, rock salt out of that, but I don't know if I did it too late or too early or what. I don't think it was too early. It might have just been too late. Or maybe it just doesn't protect me against that attack.
40k. I guess you can just dodge that attack. It seemed like. No, I keep hitting R instead of E. I'm doing it again. Okay, yeah, you can just dodge that. It's enough. Barely beat him right there with straight up no health. That boss was just tanky as hell. He did stun though, like once I restarted him and stuff, he did stun. I just did a little bit. Okay. Oh. Water Curtain Cave. this like I say it's not a big deal if I die here because like the top makes it really easy to get around but it doesn't mean that I want to have to travel like that all the time can I climb this come on you're a monkey you tell me you can't climb that is that racist probably Yeah, I want to say I just found out that for some reason like ray tracing was on and it was on cinematic I don't know why that was the case I didn't I don't think I turned that on last or maybe I did turn on ray tracing last time I don't know I don't think so though I definitely didn't have it on cinematic though. I have to restart the game though so next time I die I'll just restart the game Oops. but okay, I gotta restart the game anyways I restarted the game and my frame rate is much better now. Like I said, I turned ray tracing off and it's on high instead of cinematic. I, I don't know why I did that. The only thing I can think of is uh, I did go into the NVIDIA app, the beta, and I, uh, I had like optimized games. I'm going to go to that island next, that tree. And I had it like optimized, I think it was Overwatch 2, and maybe it did it for like all games or something. I don't one thing I just realized, I wonder if this uh, is that axe from the beginning of the game that that dude tried to slice Wukong with. I wonder if this is that. Or if it's like a hammer or something. That's like two Buddhas attached to his... or her legs to him. That's so many eyes, bro. Oh, it's forcing me down. 
<laughs> yeah, they slaughter the monkeys. Oh my god. Stop it! Idiots! Oh. Pig versus Rhino. Let's go. I guess Hog. Oh. Gold armored Rhino. My hands are sweaty. Damn you, fucking rhino, stop running. Oh, there we go, yeah, it's getting fucked up. Just chuck fucking boulders at me. No, it stuck me against the fucking invisible wall! You're being stuck with the fucking invisible walls, man! Put up a fucking barrier, like it's a golden rhino. Have it put up like lightning balls or something. So that way it's like, no, there's no invisible walls. We can definitely see where that... Jesus. Because that me stuck against the invisible walls so I couldn't make any distance. Okay, I'll wait to summon the clones until after I break the horn. It seems like it works a lot like... Uh... Like Yellow Brow, where you just have to do enough damage and the horn will break. There we go, yeah. Okay. 
This time stay well in the middle. This time I can keep my distance better. I think you just ain't quick enough. There we go. Go beat his ass. I know, I can see that. Bro, you fucking kidding me? Okay, stop with that. If I can get fucking healed. moving god them moving is the most fresh thing oh nice okay he and the fire beat him i think Ooh. That one wasn't really difficult, that one was just... He was just tanky and had a... Like a base a parry. Like a rock solid like I did. If I hit him on the horn. Oh, what did he give me? Sort the armor. That monkey was full of surprises, just like me. 
He had sure. his way to linger on, and his belongings, too. They're set on killing those mongrels of the court. But we've got to snatch them first. So this is Vulcan's armor. Scum will take them. I'll go find the other ones. Keep up with me. You really can't be talking shit, bro. Like, I've saved your ass more times. Have you saved me once? The only time when you really helped out is with the old Suzlair. Splendid, splendid. I just realized I didn't rest at the shrine, I think. So. <clears throat> I might not have my ability set enough mana unless it gives me it. In that scene. Is that a moose? Oh, it's like a moose duck looking thing, bird. Oh, this inflicts ice damage, I'm assuming. That's the worst kind, that's just shit that freezes you. Cloud shredded deer. Come on. I got a tornado too. Oh my fucking god, give me control. I didn't want to play the fucking game, I wouldn't play the game. Like I said, this is the worst debuff, and I think why it's so rare in the game. That did so much damage for no reason. This boss just fucking sucks. Like it's just it's one of those bosses just like all the other ones where it just it just takes away your ability to play the fucking game in order to be hard. Like it seemed like it didn't even have that much health or anything. It just it's like you want to play the game? How about I stop you playing the game? How about I stop that? Bro. I hate this fucking boss so much. This boss is fucking stupid. This is just like Yellow Brow, where it just it makes it so you can't play the fucking game, and it's it's really just an irritating boss. I hate it. Whatever, I'll beat it eventually. That is so fucking cheap, man. Look at that game. Come on now. I'm gonna lose this one. I'm sure. Yeah. <clears throat> This boss is bullshit. I hate it. Like I said, just like Yellow Brow's the kind of boss where it's it just inhibits your ability to play the game, and that's how it's difficult. And that it's it just feels so cheap to me when it's like we're we're just gonna stop you from playing the game in order to make it hard. Yeah. Ugh. 
this boss might actually be worse to me than Yellow Brow. Because Yellow Brow, at least there was a way to get it. Once I figured it out, it wasn't too bad. And maybe this one will be the same. Maybe like I'll figure something out to stop its tornadoes. But until I do, this boss I'd say is actually worse than Yellow Brow. I don't think that's dodgeable. I think you have to have Roxanne, but that one I literally didn't have enough time for Roxanne to come back. Like, I I think you literally can't dodge that attack where it jumps in the air. I think you have to rock solid through that or like shadow step. But I literally didn't have enough time for it to come back. And it only takes 13 seconds to come back. So you're telling me you couldn't make the boss wait 13 seconds before it does that attack again? It probably is dodgeable if it's fast, but. Yes, I was on the side of it, so it kicked me in the back. Oh, you can dodge it. Okay. I didn't even know what hurt me that time. Like, I was... I don't know. What the f... Hang on, let me take a potion. Okay, that was a cool little transformation. Oh, the little dude's here. He's got full health again. Let me try and use the tornado on him. Get up, bitch! down. Okay, let me use another poison potion. I like this phase much more than that first. Oh my god, stop! Stop fucking moving! Second phase is much better, much more balanced, much more fun to go against. Damn it, I got cut in the fucking tornadoes left behind. And this is a two-phase boss too. 
So once I beat this phase, I the second phase though seems like I said much more balanced. Which, but I almost beat it the first try. Ah! Fuck you, man! Stop fucking moving! Uh, that d it moves so much. Like at the very least, if you're gonna slow me down, at least slow the fucking deer down. Make it so it doesn't move at fifty thousand miles an hour and jumps every fucking millisecond. This boss is such bullshit, and I hit an invisible pole hole. I don't know if it'll be in the footage, but I hit an invisible wall and I couldn't move anymore. Again, with the fucking invisible walls and the bullshit ass boss. Said the vast majority of these bosses in this game have been absolutely amazing. It's just this one and Yellow Bra are the only two where I'm like, that's bullshit. And I think this one to me is worse. Because I don't think there's a way to stop the tornadoes. There probably is somehow, but it's just, it's irritating. And I think unfair and unfun. I tried to harden, but I got frozen right when I tried to hit the button. Wow, that does a lot of damage. Stop moving so fucking much! Stop fucking moving! Like, bro. Like, if they're gonna make him slow me down, please. Make it so that. He doesn't fucking move at 50 million miles an hour. Bro, you you can stun me, but you you move at fifty thousand miles an hour, and now I'm stuck in a fucking tornado minefield. What the hell did I? Dodge that perfectly. Bullshit.
Fuck off with these tornadoes! Fucking dodge the shit out of that. What are you talking about, man? Okay, yeah, here we go. I'm out of healing, though. Take a poison potion. I have something that can I I can take to like get more mana. I don't think so. Well, let's actually use this. Let me try to take another one of those and see if I can get my might back. It says I have eight stored, but I'm assuming that means that, yeah, I don't have any more here. Yes. Okay. Ooh. Yeah, that might actually have another ton there. I just just I got my mic back. Zip will transform again. Step away. This time, the glory. Honestly, fucking take it. I don't even want it. Shit's not worth it. <laughs> How cheap that shit was. That second phase was awesome. That first phase was bullshit. 
There's probably a way to, like, avoid the second phase or something. Ah, uh, here we go. These Wukong's, uh... Another part of Wukong's armor. Fine, then, fine. With you monkeys around, I'm always toiling away for nothing. <sighs> Kid, when you step up one day, try not to forget your Uncle Bajir. All I got from Wukong were the nasty jobs. You should do better than that. Oh, they're expecting me to take over for <sighs> Wukong. Now we're done here. Time to move on. I remember you as the annoying uncle, but the one who did help me out. Mostly. Ooh, yeah, that boss was interesting. Like I said, that second phase to me was great. That first phase was just dog shit. But hey, it is what it is. I thought there was going to be like a whole boss, which is why I spent all my resources right here. But hey, I'll take it. Kind of smoking here. Okay. I, I deserve that. I don't know if that's a glitch or something actually waiting to fight me, but. I see it. I saw him or her. God. I don't even know what I dodged. Oh, he's like throwing shit at me. What? Why are you not hitting him? Didn't mean to hit the R button right there. You're going underwater again? Stop going. 
going underwater. I didn't need that. Move, bitch. Oh my god, again with the underwater shit. wasn't too bad at all. Just the underwater thing, so I couldn't hit him. Oh! This is a boss. Wow. See, it looked like a someone's sitting or something. Ah, because they, they were poison sheep. Oh dear. Out the fucking game. It did that I was healing, but like Jesus. Sit your ass down. There we go. It is another boss down. Yo, when I went in, it like it like loaded him in. It's like sitting down, I think. Which maybe that's like the pose he takes if he loses and you have to come back. Let me see. If there's like something behind this waterfall. There is something that I can't go in. Maybe, can I go in there with the cloud? No. Because it looked like that was like an entrance to a cave or something, but it wouldn't let me in. I'm gonna see if I can fight this thing. It did damage me there. I want to try like land on top of it. Oh, 
Oh. I can cl Oh. I did a lot of damage to me. said the spit maybe I need to hold it I was trying to like spam it because I thought I saw it like like blinking but maybe that was because I was continuously pressing it oh it doesn't have damage okay I'm spamming F now okay spamming F is not it I let go of it because I thought it wanted me to press it again. Okay, it says hold F. I just wasn't reading. Oh, my stamina needs to be at a certain level. Oh, okay. So I can let go for a bit. Let my stamina rebuild. And then go again. Try that again. I guess you have to have a certain amount of health here. Damn, okay. Damn, bro, how much health do you have to fucking have? I feel like I've upgraded my health. A decent amount in this game, but I guess not enough for that. All right, let's do this again. Because it's fire, I'm gonna try and use the burn resistance thing instead of the like I swapped it out for the fan thing I had, and that's the last shot I can get. If I don't get past that, I'll probably just look up what to do next. Well, let's go around a bit because I feel like this is probably an optional thing. Uh, cause I could just, it just feels like something that you would do optionally. Uh, actually, you know what I'm going to do? What's my damage resistance? I'll take one of these and then I'll try and use the book and see if that works. Okay, I didn't expect it to work. I thought it was like still gonna damage me. Okay, am I gonna fight this thing now? Quite the headdress or whatever that is. Crown. Got those eyes still disturbed. Yeah. Uh, 
Splendid. <laughs> uh, with these silly strands, oh, all fight the thing? more like Wukong. Just don't prance around with your might as he did. Uh, that monkey's got a stash of treasures. I'll scout around some more. <laughs> Okay, so I guess Wukong like maybe gave this cricket thing or it just came across it and it's like, okay, I'll just hold on to it until someone worthy comes along. I did not expect the book to work because I thought I was like, oh, well, it looks like fire, so maybe I'll use it. But I thought it was going to like be like, no, nah. that's why I also use damage resistance potion. Maybe you have to use the book for that. Probably not. Actually, like, maybe you need the book to, to do that. I don't know. Oh, the snow here is gone. Look at that. Oh, except that little tree. Never mind. The game just the game is just spazzing out. Another rock. But the poison chief, didn't I already fight this guy? I'll fight him again. I've got to change the uh, my umbrella thing back. Pretty sure I already fought this guy, but he just respawned or something. But hey, I'll take it. What? Fucked up right there. What? Oh, it just started a cutscene. I was trying to fly off to go fight that frog again. Is that the bug? No, that's a mantis. That man just had actual fucking blades. It's gonna cut your hands, bro. It's in me. It's in me. What were you doing? Don't you f Kid, help me out here. This is a tough swallow. What happened? You get poisoned? Oh. You gonna go in his body? Oh. 
Oh my god. I'm assuming that he went up to the smash. Don't worry, bro. I'll try and kill this thing. Thanks. Oh, stop that! Emerald Armed Mantis. Too. I was gonna say his health seems pretty low for a boss fight. Okay, that's pretty cool. Stop stabbing him like this. Combo last so long. Oh, I'm right. I got this. So that first phase is pretty easy. Just use rock solid and beat his ass. That second phase though is tricky. Damn! How did that second hit miss? I was trying to do my resolute strike. I was one hit away, but I was like, I was got I got greedy because I was one hit away. Damn, he just comboed the shit out of me there at the end. I was trying to transform mid time. I did really good that time, like I almost killed him. I go just like before, but he just he got me locked in that combo and went to get you locked in so Damn. Fuck! Those combos, bro. Fuck, right at the end again. Yeah. Uh, this one's actually seems like it's RNG with the combos when he starts the second phase. Like a lot of bosses, they have like exact moves that they'll always do, but he seems this mantis seems like it actually kind of sometimes he'll do like this forward slash, other times he'll do that jump around thing. I actually prefer the jump around thing, it's easier for me to predict than the forward slash, but it makes it harder to like, make my uh, like plan it out as effectively. What the fuck, bitch? Why would you miss that? Oh my god. Damn. How did that fucking miss? How did that fucking miss? I was right in front of him and locked on. How did that strong attack miss? Maybe this hitbox is just janky, because like I haven't really had that with too many other bosses that I can remember. No, fuck! I should have. Uh, I was gonna use the mobilized right as it came up. I should have used that first before I tried to heal. Yeah, that one I just fucked up big time. <laughs> just died on the first one. Ugh. That's the first time in a while that's happened. I'm fumbling. All right, I'm on a roll of losing now. I'm fucking fumbling. Damn, second time in a row now I've died on the fucking first phase. Cause I'm just fumbling now. Bro, I thought I had my- that one was just cause I thought I had my rock solid. And so I was like, I'm, I was fucking spamming Z, but I guess I used it and it didn't- That's something else that needs to stop is like it fucking- It would use it, but then like I don't even get a notification that it got used. Like I don't get a sound cue or- Most of the time that happens, but there are times like that where it gets used and I don't get a cue that it got used. So then it's just like, all right, I guess it got used. Uh, 
I took a risk doing a heavy attack on that last one. I'll take. I don't think that one was like unfair or anything. It was just that that one, unlike most other bosses, for me at least, he they, that Mantis was so quick in between attacks. Like usually a lot of bosses, you know, they'll take their turn. Oh, I actually forgot we were fighting inside of his stomach. It's okay, I got you, bro. Like he, I owe you once more for saving my rump. Yes, you do. You don't care. You, you ain't got the money paying back, though. My belly's not that. too vile, is it? I'm not a meat eater after all. I hope it didn't repulse you. Oh, it did, well, but it's all right. It wasn't all that bad, eh? <laughs> now that Wu Kong's uh, no, is complete, not. we should go to Water Curtain Cave. Come with me. 
But I think I'm gonna go try and fight that frog and end episode with that. Yes. Like I said, to me, that wasn't like an unfair boss. It was just, it, to me, the reason it was so difficult was just uh, in that second phase, the time between attacks was so short. Like I said, a lot of bosses will like take time to stroll after they do a big attack. Um, but the Mantis didn't. He just attacked and he waited like one or two seconds and then immediately attacked again. And that's why it was so difficult. And yet, hey, at least for me. So. Yeah. Oof. Oh, there's no guards this time. Oh, he takes no fire damage. And he's dead, so he's probably a fire. Bro! Okay, that's enough of that. He does take damage. It's not much. I thought it was like gonna come crashing down. What? Bullshit. Oh, great. hit me nothing nothing is what hit me he was on the ground there's nothing damn you fat fucking frog stop moving so damn much damn i think that this will get him out of it last time it's just like yeah what it still got me in that Oh, 
know. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it just... I don't know what happened there, but didn't get the dying animation, but hey. It's something. Okay, that fight isn't that hard. The tornado actually gets him out of the rock phase, it looks like. So I just need to save the tornado from when he's in the rock phase. Wow, that actually killed me. It's okay. You the fucking... There we go. This should be it. There we go. Yeah, that one wasn't bad. I just needed to get him out of his rock form. Celestial Burstone Fragment. What is that? It ignores? Oh, wait. <laughs> I thought it, it meant... I would ignore it. I was going to say that shit is insane for just some random frog on the side. But no, it ignores the f enemies. OK, so that means I could still like no matter what, I could do fire damage to any. Of them. Ooh, OK, thank you so much for watching. That was actually quite a bit of fun. I didn't even accomplish that much this episode. Um, I just I fought like what, three, four bosses uh, and like, I mean, I probably accomplished about what I usually accomplish in other episodes. But yeah, that's uh, ooh, those bosses were kind of rough. I've been recording for seven hours and eight minutes now. Now, to be fair, there were like, I think about an hour and a half, two hours that I was away from the computer. It's still recording. but So really more like five, five and a half hours. That's how long I've actually been playing the game. But that's a lot of time. I feel like for the amount of stuff I got done, I feel like I could have gotten in shorter, but I just got stuck on some of those boss fight. Horse boss fight was bullshit. At least that first phase. That second phase I thought was really cool, but that first phase was bullshit. Worse than yellow brow to me, I think.
that's something I have to really sit there and think about. But it seems like from what Baje said, you're going to replace Wukong because he said, you know, don't go around with your weight like Wukong did or with your might. But I thought that the whole point was we were going to bring Wukong back. I didn't think that we were replacing him per se, but I guess that's what's happening. I was planning to try and finish the game today, but just it took me longer than I thought. And here in a couple hours, I got to get some sleep because I got to work tomorrow. I'll finish it next time I play, and then I do want to work on the secret ending. Like I said, I don't know what the secret ending is, what the regular ending is. I just know that there's a true, like a true or secret ending because of titles that I've seen on YouTube. That there's like a true ending, and it's different from the regular ending. So I'm like, okay. Like one will say ending, and the other one will say true ending of the video. So I'm like, okay, obviously there's two different endings or whatever, or however many different endings. So yeah, I am loving this game. So far, the only two bosses that I felt like were absolute bullshit were Yellowbrow and that horse one, whatever that was. Those two are the only ones where I'm like, that was some bullshit. But other than that, I've been enjoying the Hell's Game just to kind of give you a note as to where, like, where I am uploading wise while I'm recording this. If you're watching this part, I've only uploaded chapters one and two on my channel, like the one where I beat uh, the Yellow Wind Sage. I just uploaded that like yesterday or the day before of me recording this. No, actually, I uploaded it today. I edited it. I finished editing it yesterday and I got everything done and then it went up today. So the day that the Yellow Wind Sage video went up, that's when I'm recording this. So, yeah, next time I plan to I, uh, just to like give you a note as to like where I am recording this versus uploading. So you can go back and see when the Yellow Wind Sage like a, I think it's number four, part four of the series so far. That's the part I uploaded today. So you can go back and see. And that's when I'm recording this. So that's like how backed up I am on recordings. Normally I'm not like that, but I've just been enjoying this game so much. And like, I'm not in a big rush. Like it's whatever. I'll, I'll get the videos out when I get them out. And I'm actually trying to put a little bit more effort into my editing. I'm not doing way better, but I actually do want to get better with editing and try to make my videos more appealing and basically more how I would watch them. That's why I'm time stamping them now. I wasn't doing that before. Um, I, I, I want to make them more viewable, more, you know, give, give viewers a more enjoyable experience. I guess that we're replacing Wukong, though. Like I said, I, I didn't think that we were going to replace him, but I guess we are. That beetle thing was pretty cool. I did not think the book was going to work on that. Uh, I just, I figured out oh, why not give it a try because it looked like fire. So I'm like, I'll give the book a try. But I didn't think it would actually work. That's why I used a damage resistance potion. And I was going to use that and see if it, I actually want to see, does the damage potion, the damage reduction potion also stack with the, the extra health potion? I would assume it does because those are two different ones, but the two health potions didn't stack. The two extra health potions didn't stack. So maybe it won't stack there either, but I would assume because those are two different potions, uh, but that, that was kind of cool. So it was fire and the beetle, I was expecting to fight the beetle and the beetle had a fucking health bar, which is weird. That means like maybe there is a way to fight it or maybe like it was meant to be a boss at some point. And then they just did away with it because it's, it's so weird that like at the bottom of the screen, it popped up its name and a health bar. Maybe that was to throw the player off to like make you think you were going to fight it. Uh, I didn't even think it was going to let me land on top of it, to be honest. I thought I was going to either like get pushed off or like bounce off. Like the beetle was going to jump as soon as I land on top of it and throw me off or something. But that was actually a pretty cool one. That was the only one where I didn't have to fight to get a part of Wukong's armor. Uh, Wukong's armor. And I'm all decked out in Wukong's armor, which is really fucking cool. Uh, his armor actually looks amazing. No joke. It might be my favorite in the game. I also like that. Uh, um, I did like that hat I had. I don't know which one I like more headwear wise between that hat that I had and or Wukong's like feathers or whatever the hell those are. But both of them are really cool looking. So that shit was amazing. Uh, anyways, I'm ranting again. But it's my video. I'll do whatever the fuck I want. But thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Next time, I'll see you guys there trying to finish the game. Thank you so much for watching. Greatly appreciate it. Have a great day. And uh, yeah, see ya.